How to read residual current device, RCD, markings and labels. In this video, we will look at what information is marked on household residual current devices, RCCBs and RCBOs, that comply with IEC 61008-1 and IEC 61009-1. Marking and other product information for RCCB. Each residual current operated circuit breaker without integral overcurrent protection, abbreviated as RCCB, shall be marked in a durable manner with all or, for small apparatus, part of the following data. A. The manufacturer's name or trademark. B. Type designation, catalog number or serial number. C. Rated voltage. Un. D. Rated frequency, RCCBs with more than one rated frequency, e.g. 50 sixtieths hertz, shall be marked accordingly, E. Rated current, in, F. Rated residual operating current, in. G. Settings of residual operating current for RCCBs with multiple residual operating current settings. H. Rated making and breaking capacity, I'm, J, the degree of protection, only if different from IP20, K, the position of use, if necessary. L. Rated residual making and breaking capacity, M, if different from rated making and breaking capacity, M, the symbol, S, in a square, for type S devices. N. Indication that the RCCB is functionally dependent on line voltage, if applicable, under consideration. O. Operating means of the test device, by the letter T, P, wiring diagram. Q. Operating characteristic in presence of residual currents with DC components. RCCBs of type AC with the symbol IEC 60417-6148. RCCBs of type A with the symbol IEC 60417-6149. If, for small devices, the space available does not allow all the above data to be marked, at least the information under E, F, M, O, and Q only for type A shall be marked and visible when the device is installed. The information under A, B, C, K, L, P, and Q only for type AC may be marked on the side or on the back of the device and be visible only before the device is installed. Alternatively, the information under P may be on the inside of any cover which has to be removed in order to connect the supply wires. Any remaining information not marked shall be given in the manufacturer's catalogs. The manufacturer shall state the joule integral and the peak current IP with stand capabilities of the RCCB. Where these are not stated, minimum values as given in Table 18 IEC 610081 apply. The manufacturer shall give the reference of one or more suitable SCPDs in his catalogs and in a sheet accompanying each RCCB. Marking and other product information for RCBO. Each residual current operated circuit breaker with integral overcurrent protection, abbreviated as RCBO, shall be marked in a durable manner with all or, for small apparatus, part of the following data. A. Manufacturer's name or trademark. B. Type designation, catalog number or serial number. C. Rated voltage. Un. D. Rated current in without symbol A. Preceded by the symbol of overcurrent instantaneous tripping, B, C, or D, for example, B16. E. Rated frequency, RCBOs with more than one rated frequency, e.g. 50 sixtieths hertz, shall be marked accordingly, F. Rated residual operating current, in. G. Settings of residual operating current for RCBOs with multiple residual operating currents, H. Rated short circuit capacity, ICN, in amperes. J. Reference calibration temperature, if different from 30 degrees Celsius. K. The degree of protection. Only if different from IP20. L. The position of use, if necessary. M. Rated residual making and breaking capacity. M. If different from rated short circuit capacity. N. The symbol, S in a square, for type S devices. 
O, indication that the RCBO is functionally dependent on line voltage, if applicable, under consideration. P, operating means of the test device, by the letter T, Q, wiring diagram. R, operating characteristic in presence of residual currents with DC components. RCBOs of type AC with the symbol IEC 60417-6148. RCBOs of type A with the symbol IEC 60417-6149. S, for type D RCBOs, the maximum instantaneous tripping current, if higher than 20 in, see table 4 IEC 610091. If, for small devices, the space available does not allow all the above data to be marked, at least the information under D, F, N, P, and R only for type A shall be marked and visible when the device is installed. The information under A, B, C, H, L, R only for type A, C, and S may be marked on the side or on the back of the device and be visible only before the device is installed. The information under Q may be on the inside of any cover which has to be removed in order to connect the supply wires. Any remaining information not marked shall be given in the manufacturer's catalogs. What do the numbers and letters on a residual current device mean? For examples of RCD labeling, see below on screen. Figure 1. Two-pole RCCB series ABB F200 marking. Figure 1 shows 1. Manufacturer's trademark, 2. Serial number, 3. Rated current in equals 100A. 4. Rated voltage on equals 230V. 5. Rated making and breaking capacity IM and rated residual making and breaking capacity IM equal to 1000A. 6. Rated current of the fuse is 100A. 7. Rated conditional short circuit current inc equals 10,000A. 8. Operating means of the test device. 9. Position indicator. 10. Ambient air temperature from 25 to plus 40 degrees Celsius. 11. RCCB designation of type AC. 12. Rated residual operating current in equals 0, 0, 003. 13. Push button, disabled position. Example 2, RCBO. Figure 2. Two-pole RCBO series ABB DS941 marking. Figure 2 shows. 1. Manufacturer's trademark. 2. Serial number. 3. Operating means of the test device. 4. Instantaneous tripping. C. Rated current in equals 16A. 5. Rated short circuit capacity ICN equals 4500A, 6, ambient air temperature from 25 to plus 40 degrees Celsius. 7. Rated voltage on equals 230V, 8, push button, disabled position, 9. RCBO designation of type A, 10, rated residual operating current in equals 0, 0, 003. Example 3, residual current unit. Figure 3. Two-pole RCU series DDA202 marking. Figure 3 shows. 1. Manufacturer's trademark. 2. Serial number. 3. Operating means of the test device. 4. Rated residual operating current in equals 0, 0, 003. 5. RCD designation of type A. 6. Ambient air temperature from 25 to plus 40 degrees Celsius. 7. RCD actuator acting on the holding device in the circuit breaker mechanism. 8. Push button, disabled position. 9. Conductors intended for electrical connection of the RCD and circuit breaker. And there you have it, folks. You're now a RCD's marking maestro. Remember, these markings are your guide to a safer and more efficient electrical system. If you found this video enlightening, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more electrifying content, and share with fellow enthusiasts. Until next time, stay safe and stay curious. Thank you for joining us on this illuminating journey. Be sure to connect with us on social media for more informative content. Stay empowered with knowledge and remember, your safety matters.
See you in the next video.